guys, it's us site after dark. Back again for our Steely Dan Can't Buy a Thrill wrap up. This was an amazing album. We loved it every step of the way. I kind of feel weird sometimes listening to albums with a camera on me because I kind of like daydream and close my eyes and all types of stuff <laughs> and shit. And then I'm like, oh shit, I'm on camera. One person in one video was like, is she awake? <laughs> I am awake, I just love the music. Like, what do you want me to do? This album is great. Still can't believe how many songs we knew off this. Right. Because, I don't know, it, it's just kind of surprising. Like, we knew that we knew basically two songs. We knew we knew Do It Again, and we knew that we knew Real End of the Years, and yeah. we thought that was it. Right. And the first whole half of the album we pretty much had already heard before. Mm -hmm. So that's just amazing. So shout out. That proves how good and timeless the music is, that it gets out there even without us knowing who it is. Right, that's true. That's definitely true. Um, I was uh, kind of thrown by all the changes of the guard, in a way. Like, um, you know, they had a different singer for mm -hmm. um, for uh, Dirty Work. and um, Midnight Cruiser, I think. Yeah, Midnight yeah. Cruiser as well. So... Um, that was an interesting thing. It's cool to see like the band uh, evolve in a way. Like that was cool. I thought. What was your favorite song? I have to say it's gonna be fire in the hole. I think that's my favorite one. I really like it. Anything in particular, or just like the groove? I like the groove of it. Yeah, yeah you know, it's got that, that walking piano, strut. Yeah, 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 like yeah. Just, yeah, that's dope. That, there, it, oh, didn't you say you're like if you you have to strut if you're listening to this? You can't yeah, walk. I think it was one. You, you said it. I think you I said, said that. I, maybe. Yeah. Oh, I think so. Sorry for uh, promoting myself, guys. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what you and it's just um, uh, I'm kind of really partial to New York things. You know, not that I don't like other states and other places and stuff, but that piano is like that's very New York to me. Like you know, so like I love it. Um, the writing was great. Uh, Music is great. I'm partial to New York. I love, let's talk about this artwork. Yeah, let's talk about the artwork. Um, what is it? Yeah. Well, <laughs> is, she, is it licorice? What's in her mouth? Swizzle stick? Which one? Swizzle straw? The red lip girl. Um, is it a swizzle straw? Like, what's in her mouth? I don't know. They have Those are bananas up to the upper right corner. I just noticed that. Yeah, I just saw that too. Um, At first, I thought these people were like, in the subway because of the poles, but I realize that's not a subway car. Yeah, look they're like- tall, Look how high this, the walls are. Right. Seat. It looks like they're outside somewhere, honestly, on the west side. Like somewhere, and, and honestly, it looks somewhere between 34th and 42nd. It really does. It, it really does. But maybe they're outside of Rudy's. Right, maybe outside of Rudy's, maybe outside of some triple X place or something. It's the 70s, I don't know. Those places- You let old. us know. Yeah. And I think this is a swizzle stick. I think uh, in the 70s they had swizzle sticks, which used to go in the drinks, and they were like different colors and stuff. I think it was glass. And they, because they used to give us, when my big cousins used to give us kids candy ones. And we used to have candy ones in our in our um, things in like the late 80s growing Isn't up. Isn't that just so. like a drink mixer though? I think so. But yeah. it's candy. Right, ours were candy, but I think theirs are plastic. I don't know why hers is in her mouth. Maybe she's a slut. She just likes to put things in her mouth. I don't know. I'm joking. How do you even know that's a girl? That her teeth are too perfect to be <laughs> It has nothing to do with the lipstick. Um, I think I don't even know what my favorite song is. Um, it might be "Do It Again." Honestly, I really like how um, the beat, like it starts off, kind of like almost with like a Latin beat kind of feel. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like there's like some congos and shit in there. That's true. And then it just totally switches the vibe. Like right when the keyboards come in. Right. And then it just kind of gets like grittier and grittier as it goes on, I feel. Yes, yes, yes. And you know what? That actually um, triggers something in my mind. Growing up, I used to think Do It Again was Santana when it used to start. I did. Ah, I and could it, see that. I right? could see that for sure. And then it almost kind of even sounds like the song, The Low Riders, that old song too. Right? Mm hmm Yeah. Mm hmm Definitely got a Mexican. Low ride. Yeah. I always think of George Lopez when I hear that song, because that was his <laughs> theme song for a show. Really? Yeah. You never watched the show, the George Lopez show? I watched his stand-up, and I remember, I just remember one funny joke of that. he said. It was really funny. Shout out to George Lopez. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to Steely Dan. Um, I guess 
Yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, tell us what album we should do next. Yeah. Don't tell us another Steely Dan album because we're going to, you know, do that as time goes on. Eventually, yeah. Somebody that's not Steely Dan preferred just because we can, we like to broaden our horizons and all that good stuff. Yeah. Um, check out our shirts. <laughs> They're online, available for purchase. And we send warm oh. hugs with them when we ship them to you. Only one per person. <laughs> but yeah, so tell us what album we should do next. Uh, like, subscribe, hit all the buttons. Yeah. Do all the things. Right. They actually did this logo, the Stilly Dan logo, like a baseball. It's like an old Dodgers kind of um, logo. Yeah. Right? That looks like um, something you'd see on like one of the shirts. It's like white, but it has the colored sleeves. Yes, uh, those <laughs> old school shirts. Those yeah, are classic. Yeah, yeah. We really love those. Well, you hit a home run, Stilly Dan. <laughs> Out of the fucking park. <laughs> Alright, so we're Slide After Dark. That was Do It Again by Steely Dan. Watch all the videos if you haven't. I'm hoping you've seen it if you're going to watch this and spend time of your life watching us talk about this album. Um, but if you haven't watched them, go watch them. And we'll see you soon. See ya.